Hey sports fans, based on the limited information that we have, it appears that Ilhan Omar never obtained her U.S. citizenship. According to the U.S. Constitution, Article 1, Section 2, Clause 2, uh, a person who serves in the Congress has to have been seven years a citizen of the United States. Now, the Omar family moved to the U.S. in 1995, and by law, refugees must be a lawful permanent resident for five years to be eligible to apply for U.S. citizenship. That would have been the year 2000 for her father. Um, the limited sources that we have show that she became a citizen in 2000 when she was 17. The New York Times, AP News show that she was uh, 17 when she became a citizen in 2000. The problem with that is that Ilhan Omar was not 17 in the, U in the year 2000. How do we know? Well, because numerous sources and her Minnesota legislative page show that her birth date was October 4th, 1981. Omar was not eligible to gain U.S. citizenship in 2000 as a minor. She, that is when she turned 19. So uh, the immigration laws provide for three main mechanisms that a U.S. citizen or refugee parent can potentially use to seek citizenship for their child. The first one, acquisition, acquisition of citizenship. If you or your spouse or both are United States citizens and your child was born abroad, this does not apply to Ilhan Omar because her, her parents were not U.S. citizens when she was born in Somalia. Number two, derivation of citizenship. For children of refugees whose child turned 18 years old on or after February 27, 2001, and this does not apply, derivation of citizenship does not apply because she turned 19 in the year 2000. Number three, application for citizenship under Section 322 of the Immigration and Naturalization Act. One parent is a U.S. citizen, usually by naturalization. Now, remember, her father could only apply for naturalization in the year 2000 and the child has to be under the age of 18 which she was not so number three does not apply to Ilhan Omar it appears Ilhan Omar never obtained US citizenship as an adult in the year 2000 when she was 19 and then legally eligible to become to apply and become a US citizen Ilhan Omar has not corrected the record U.S. citizenship is a requirement to serve in the U.S. Congress and the American people have a right to verify that U.S. citizenship. Naturalization records are only obtainable through a Freedom, Freedom of Information Act request. Here's the catch. That request will not be answered unless Omar gives her permission for that request to be fulfilled. So until Ilhan Omar provides proof of her U.S. citizenship. Rather than thinking of her as a dual citizen, we will think of her as a Somali nationalist. Ilhan Omar, the American people have a right to know. We need verification that you actually obtained U.S. citizenship. I'm A.J. Kern, and I approve this message.